Hello everybody, my makeup looks effed up. I can't even come by my freckles properly. Okay, anyways, good morning guys. Um I'm stupid because today is Saturday? Yeah, Saturday. And um yesterday night I couldn't sleep or <laughs> like I forced myself to not sleep and now I'm I woke up I never woke up and I just woke up super early and I I literally got out of my house at like 6 a.m. because I'm bored and I'm trying to be healthy I was like half the time I'm not this lighting is terrible half the time I'm not healthy I don't even exercise and I just feel like I'm so unfit I need to start um, exercising and just then I walk past a car that was starting and it, I'm walking outside right now at like 6 something or like 7 something and then I was just guessing the people in the car were probably staring at me going like what is this woman doing this early in the morning on a Saturday morning just walking and then the car I'm, I'm guessing, not that I know for a fact or anything, I'm guessing they were just in the car going, what is this woman doing? Like, it's Saturday morning. You shouldn't be in bed sleeping until 12 in the afternoon. Except no, this strange lady over here is walking all the way to the near shopping center and then back. But the reason is no. I'm not just walking in there, I'm walking in there, getting a coffee. And then, will I retract to my own home? That car is probably looking at me like, what the fuck, too? Um, and hopefully this thing opens. It doesn't open? Okay. And that means I gotta wait in the front there at some weird um, fast food restaurant until this shop open. My mom's probably wondering where the F is her daughter and it's like, I'm outside. I don't want to stay in home. So as I'm walking and then I walked past a security guard with the like the light orange vest and I was trying, I was filming and I'm trying not to be awkward because I don't want to be suspicious. Otherwise he'll think, okay, it's the Saturday morning. Okay. And this woman is walking. I don't want him to come up and question me while I'm making videos. That would just seem like I'm a criminal and I ain't no criminal. Okay? I know I I mean no criminal. <laughs> okay? So I'm just like trying to be awfully just natural and not trying to be creepy or anything. Okay. An update on Halloween. It has been like let's see. Two days before or three. I don't know, I don't know what you're to living in, but yeah, um, it ended, and then what happened was at 6 a.m. where we should be going around wanting candy, me, me and my family drove all the way to Costco. I'm pretty sure where you live, that's Costco too. We. When I should be trick or treating, we drove all the way to Costco. It took like hours or something. And then we drove all the way over there. And then, guess what? Um, we came back at like 8 p.m. We were about to go trick or treating for like another hour, seven. I think it was seven. I don't know how. I don't, I don't have no time. I think it was seven or eight. And we'll go about trick or treating for another one or two hours. But no. We were forced to stay home and eat dinner. I'm like, bro, I don't care about dinner anymore. All I care about is the candy. Like, how can I not have candy when it's Halloween? Halloween is all about candy, you know? And then we were forced to stay home and just eat dinner. And then we, I, cause, well, I'm really mad. Well, I'm not, I wasn't really mad because I want to be the perfect child, but my sister was so mad. She was upset. She was literally crying because 
we bought we bought all our costumes we bought the fake blood the eye sticker the tattoos all the other all these um shit and i got my fangs and all that and there's all the really good things that i could stick on and all that and then we put in all that effort but in the end we couldn't go anywhere so after we figured we couldn't go trick or treating she was so sad she was actually crying she was like bawling out tears and her she she was like complaining to my mom oh but uh, uh, i spent all this time getting ready and now i can't go i'm so upset i'm going through a tunnel over here i'm so upset and then my mom was like look at your sister she's okay and i'm just like yeah i, I want to cry too but i gotta set a good example so i didn't cry and then she she got so mad she literally locked herself in my mom's bedroom just in her pajamas and she was just so sad she was just sitting there and she was like literally she it, it felt like her aura it's just like this dark aura <laughs> and she was just so upset and then like my friend the one uh, Andy my boyfriend was watching this and I I have a feeling he's gonna be mad. Um, Andy, he was like, okay, fine, we'll take you. And she was like, oh, really? I'm so happy. And I'm like, okay, this is gonna be fun. Bad news, because it was 9 a.m., I hate the lighting. The fuck the lighting? Fuck the lighting. Um, so, um, it was 9 p.m. And my mom was like, no one's going to be open at 9 p.m. No one will shut the doors on you. They're going to sleep. And I was like, no, they're not. <laughs> no, I was like, fine, we're not going. And my sister was like, no, I'm going to get the candy whether she likes it or not. So I'm going to stick here into my video. So we ended up uh, going. And then, um, yeah, we went to my neighbor's house we went to a uh, people's house i don't even know and then what happened was um no one opened the door and even though clearly the lights were on i knocked on the door i rang the doorbell no one opened the door and i'm like if you if you were lights open where the hell are you because there's trick-or-treaters coming around there's a light trick-or-treaters and then we came to our neighbor's house. She was really nice. She gave us like chocolate bars, you know, Mars bars, caramel, koala, Fred, Fred frog. I don't know, Her, uh, the chocolate frog. And then um, lollipops, Snickers. And then I was like, whoa, you're really nice. And then we just decided, you know what, everyone's already asleep. We're just gonna go to this one house. So 